What's up? It's Chunky. Welcome to another segment of Chunky is Beautiful and I'm in a new place just because I feel like the lighting here is better. Every time I film in my living room, the videos come out fucked up and I've been really mad about the way my videos have been coming out for this segment. Like, I'm just not liking it. But, you know what? It's, if first you don't succeed, try, try again, okay? So, let's get right into it. Today's segment is going to be what a chunky woman uses to keep her hygiene up, to keep, you know, to keep herself looking fly, to keep herself looking good, you know, keep herself looking right. <laughs> so let's get into it. I'm going to be showing you a few of my products that I use from my teeth to my, you know what I mean. All right, let's get into it. All right, so the first thing I'm going to be showing you is what I use on my teeth. Now, I get a lot of questions and I get a lot of, I've seen a lot of comments talking about my teeth. And somebody has even asked me before what I use on my teeth. Is that a fucking hula hoop in the tree? A lot of people asking me what I use on my teeth. And I've told them before, I've said it before, and I have no problem sharing it. Um, I think it works because people have been noticing. I know, you know... I'd say like a couple of months ago before I started using it, I started noticing that my teeth were yellow because I do drink a lot of Diet Coke and I drink a lot of coffee and shit like that. So I use the Optic White, Colgate Optic White um, mouthwash and then I also use the toothpaste. So I've been using this combo and it's been pretty good for me. I guess people have been noticing. Um, yeah, so I take pride in my smile, you know, I, I get a lot of compliments on my smile not to toot my own motherfucking horn but you know um yeah so i use the optic white i'm not sponsored i wish i was so colgate hit a girl up hit a chola up right so let's move on to the next item so nobody has really asked me about this product but i'm gonna let you know what my armpits are smelling like and what i'm using on these uh nice little pits of mine uh i'm using the degree right now i usually use like the clinical protection because you know what I have bad pits like I have bad armpits I don't know if anybody ha else has this problem but my armpits are really bad and the cl the the clinical the clinical secret or the clinical degree they have those it's a clinical one it comes in a box I usually use that one but it's really expensive I think it's like almost $13 so I wanted to find a cheaper alternative uh, I wanted to try more out so this one works pretty good for me and I have bad armpits so if you have bad armpits like me this one's pretty good okay check mark that shit because it works pretty good all right next next product is what I shave with when I shave because I don't shave a lot but when I shave I shave the Venus I shave the Venus I use the Venus, Venus Gillette. This is what I use. And see, I haven't even opened it yet because I have not shaved yet. My legs are looking kind of hairy, but I haven't worn any shorts or anything. I only shave when I need to. And really, I don't give a fuck because my hair, like I'm not like a hairy person. I told you, like my hair doesn't come out like, rrr, like, rrr, you know, my hair isn't, isn't like ferocious. So, you know, it's just real light and, um, kind of blondish my hair is kind of blondish but anyways yeah so why do i need it why do i feel the need to share so much i don't fucking know but that's the shit i use so right now for body wash i'm really liking this um body wash right here it smells so fucking good it's the doubt miracle oil and it's for for beautifully soft skin restoring body wash and then it says like this thing right here but it smells oh my god look smell it it smells so oh my god it smells so fucking good but i'm really liking this right now i actually noticed it because i use let me bring the, the hold on one second okay so i noticed the dowel this one because i use dowel for my private area and we'll get into that in a minute but I noticed that it was the same brand. It was like kind of near the same place. And I was like, hmm, Dow's pretty good for, you know, cleansing well. I know Dow is really like a good cleanser. You could use it like when you get um, piercings. Like they suggest to use it when you have tattoos. Use it on, to wash your tattoos. So I, I heard that it has like a um, antibacterial in it. So I know it's really good for that. So 
that's why I trust it on my other areas but we'll get into that right now but yeah this is what I'm using right now I usually really like to use the um herbal essence body as well this one's all used up but oh my god these two smell really good okay the herbal essence if you haven't smelled the herbal essence for your body like where what are you doing if oh my god herbal essence smells so fucking delicious on your hair so fucking delicious but imagine it for your body oh, oh i love herbal essence like it really does make you like uh like uh but oh i love herbal essence like it really does make you like uh like so I'm not gonna get too much into hair right now but as for shampoo since we're like kind of in the shower right now I use Pantene I really love Pantene um I use the shampoo this is the conditioner because I just grabbed the conditioner because the shampoo look crazy but this is the sheer volume and I do need volume because my hair is thin but I really do love Pantene like Pantene I know people like some people like to talk shit about it you know everybody's different everybody's hair is different that's why there's different products um i know that my um a good friend of mine she uses pantene and her hair like she's always swear by pantene and her hair is so beautiful so thick well before i started using it because a lot of people used to tell me that it wasn't good for your hair it was your hair down like that supposedly is not good for your hair but and then like I had a couple of friends that used to do hair so they'll be like oh don't use Pantene like use this one and I think they were just trying to sell their products and their products were more expensive but Pantene let me tell you okay I fucking swear by Pantene my hair is better than ever like I started using it after because my I my hair was just literally just like going through a fucked up stage but now it's good now it's really shiny it's really bouncy it's like i really like it right now right now i'm just in the process of growing it out because i told you i did have like a disaster where like my hair was falling out and i bleached it and it was ugly that was the ugly stage but right now my two main products i'm just using is coconut oil for a conditioning treatment and Pantene for when I wash it and condition it okay so with the theme of hair I always like to use a dry shampoo now this is the ion dry shampoo this is what it says right there dry shampoo really good to spray in between washes just to um because you know when your hair gets really oily even if you're just a woman that especially if you're a woman that doesn't want to wash their hair every day but they have really oily hair i would suggest a dry shampoo so really look into dry shampoos they could really refresh your hair you don't want to smell like gaspa because a lot of people you know they don't want to wash their hair but they smell like gaspa so you don't want to fucking smell like gaspa and gaspa is dandruff okay and dandruff you do smell like dandruff some people do smell like dandruff so i really would suggest using a dry shampoo in between washes for what am i using to wash my face a lot of people have this question what do you use on your face now this week i've had a really bad pms like really bad and i have like some blemishes here as you could see but also what was contributing contributing to the breakouts was <laughs> i have really fucking weird skin like my skin is so fucking strange you know what honestly i think if i get too dry like i can't use harsh products on my face like when i use harsh products on my face i break out more so i can't use like any acne scrubs for if i have blemishes right now like i can't use any acne shit like to, to i gotta just let my own body just heal it um so what i do is i use something very gentle on my face i can't use anything that will dry my face anything that like scrubs my face because i get i break out it's so fucking weird like it's almost like if i don't wash my face it's almost like my face looks better like my face looks more clear and more like if i just forget to oh fuck it i'm just not gonna wash my face tonight like i'm just not gonna like i'm just gonna leave my face oily like my face will look so fucking good like it is so fucking weird i don't know if anybody else is like that i know my two friends um that I talked to they were saying that they were like that and they were like asking me what do you use on your face and I'm like girl you can trip out I use baby wash on my face because my face is like a fucking baby um but yeah I use baby wash as if so if you're like me um let me explain it better 
my face is very dry so I have very dry skin on my face my face dries up for fucking everything if I don't moisturize for one day like my face will dry up so I always have to use and believe me it's not because of my water intake because all I drink is water and Diet Coke and I try not to drink too much Diet Coke unless I'm eating like you know I drink it like one time while I'm eating and the rest of the day I'm drinking water so that's all I fucking drink I don't drink anything else but water and Diet Coke but maybe the Diet Coke is drying me out I don't know I've always been that way but my face dries so quickly and I cannot use any harsh products so I use baby wash okay baby wash is really good if you have sensitive skin um, also in between because I mean I do have to exfoliate once in a while so I'll use my baby wash and then I'll use um, these St. Ives products are really good and that's why I broke out too because I didn't have any more baby I didn't have any more baby wash because usually like all stock up right and I I just was have been so busy this week and I was sick and all that stuff I wasn't able to go buy my my I barely bought this one but I wasn't able to go buy any for my face so I was just using any soap to wash my face and it really was fucking up my face and I was also using this one like every day like for the cup for past like couple of days for like couple days in a row I used this and it really dried up my face so that's why I broke out but this I will use once a week or once every two weeks you know or if I'm going to a special event I will scrub I will exfoliate my face before I put on my makeup but yeah this is what I use to exfoliate and then this is one of the mask product I use so I'll do this once a week as well it's a mask or once every two weeks it's just or if I'm going to like a special event before I go I'll put me a mask just to make my skin look extra clean or whatever it just feels good to like pamper yourself before you go out somewhere so this is an actual mask and um i'll put the na name of the the products it's just clears pores and soothes skin so it's just a clay mask and you just put it all over it looks like this it looks all crazy it's like really like feels like clay but yeah this is the mask i use and this is the scrub i use okay saint ives and this this one here I've you I've said this I've used this one before in some of my older videos but yeah those are the stuff I use on my face last but certainly not least let's get to the vaginal area <laughs> to the um you know punani area I don't know whatever you want to call it I call it punani um if I want to get technical if, and I'm and I'm kind of angry I say vagina but yeah so um this is what i use to wash my vagina it's um i could i'll use this one or there's another brand either or but i don't know i really like this i really like this one this is um an odor block it doesn't matter there's different smells this one smells just very fresh and with a little bit of little little fruity but I always use something special to wash down there just because you don't want to use you don't want to use the same um, washes that you're using on your like the, the body washes I noticed that I'm very prone to getting um, UTIs and stuff like that I know I've heard a lot of people on YouTube surprisingly say I'm sorry for the kids the kids are outside um, surprisingly a lot of people have been sharing their UTIs so free on YouTube lately and I'm just like yes girl preach for all the sensitive area girls okay so if you're a sensitive area girl as well I would suggest using um, a wash like this not even just being sensitive as a woman you need to take initiative in yourself and um, and just spend a little bit extra time making sure that your areas are clean especially if you're sexually active or you have you have had children just take initiative and getting making yourself feel special as well it just feels special when you have a special cleaner for that special area you know what I mean but yeah this is the one I use but then also I use my dowel bar so what I use my dowel bar bar for is like the outside area like this I put like you know inside and then this i put like outside i wash the outside area i don't know i just feel cleaner i feel like it's washing away stuff it's an antibacterial it's i don't know i just 
I just love this combo. I just feel extra squeaky clean in that area when I use this combo. Um, the This is just a bar. I just scrub, you know, the outside and, you know, your 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 booty area you gotta clean your booty so i like i love to wash my booty with this too with this bar like your booty feels so clean after but yeah i wash both both areas with these okay you just scrub it and you're gonna feel extra nice let me know if you guys try this combo and tell me how you feel about it so i think that's pretty much it right now for right now i hope you guys like this segment i hope you guys um I hope I answered pretty much all your questions or all your questions that you haven't asked me about certain stuff I use. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys have a wonderful day and stay chunky because chunky is beautiful.